Now, uh, the way you're going to get your layers up is to go into Options and to choose Layers. And you can see here I've already docked this palette. Um, you typically, if this is floating over here, then you can drag it and drop it and um, drop it uh, into the middle over here and it will become part of the, the palettes. Uh, let me do that one more time. I actually did this already once. So that, that would be the scenario that you would have if you've gone Options, Layers, you typically get that. And then you can drag the title block into the middle over there and drop it. And now you have a Layers palette that you can use uh, to um, add different layers. So I'm going to right click in this area down here and create a new layer. I'm just going to choose the default names. Um, but you would uh, usually create meaningful names here like doors and windows or roofs or uh, plumbing or electrical. Um, that would be the, the, the typical uh, scenario where you'd actually put in layer names here. Now I'm also going to change the color of the layer so that we can see a different color for each of these options and then this is very very useful to assign a, a layer to um, a color to each of these layers because as you're drawing then um, we can assign uh, you'll be quickly be able to see if you've assigned the color to be by the layer <coughs> let's give it a full brush button now I can go and draw that line over there and you can see it picks up the color from the layer um, let's go and change the layer now to be number two and then we can draw that over there and you can see it picks the, the, the layer up from that color. So depending on which layer I've got, we're controlling which colors we're using in the drawing. And we can come and change those colors depending on what we uh, think is a, a good or, or a good visual representation of what we need.